So guys, today, <coughs> excuse me, I just woke up. It's 7.30 in the morning, my alarm just went off, and I'm recording a day in the life of a nanny. Yeah, so this is real raw, you know, real day to day. Not a beautiful video, it's just the real life of a living nanny. My bed is so comfortable, by the way. These blankets, oh my gosh, amazing. I don't know what they are, but they're so comfortable. Now, I just walk over here to the bathroom, get ready to take a shower. Okay, so I'm all dressed, guys. And remember, I work in the house, so I don't have to get all fancy or, you know, get all dressed up and just wear a short suit. Um, the parents are gone in LA and I have to help take care of the five little puppies. So I don't do this every day. Just these couple of days that they're gone. And you'll hear them barking in a second. That's Kiki. This is Christina. Hola. Hola. Buenos dias. Buen dia. Como tu estas? Oh, yeah. Sí, cansada. Yo me escuchaba a Kiki a cada rato. ¿Qué es lo que tenía? No, no sé. No sabe. Uh, Kiki. Sí, estaba gritando eh, mucho. Sí. Hi, I get up. Mm, she made breakfast, guys. Hi. Oh, gracias. Muy bien. Yeah, this is Christina. She is here, the night nurse. I mean, the night nanny because they're out of town, so she's here to help out at night with us. The dogs are all in there, so we're going to let them out now. They're so excited. They've been sleeping in the crates. Well, the kennels all night. Usually they sleep with their parents in the bed, so these are the little pups. Hey, Scrappy. This is about 8 a.m. here, and um, yeah, it's beautiful already, as you can see. The baby, I know you guys are wondering, she's still asleep. <laughs> Got some natural, healthy food here. Beef and green beans. And we'll finish the rest of the beef and carrots as well. So, let's see how she likes them. Hi, Chunks. So, yeah, she has a straw water cup that she drinks water from. We've been working on straws. It probably took her... One day to get the hang out of sucking out of the straws. Very, very, very. These are very good cups. I don't know if you're trying to get your kids to drink out of straws, but it allows you to squeeze it and give them water at the same time so they understand how to how to um, suck. Let me show you. I don't want to get wet, but see? The water comes out if you squeeze it a little bit. But now she knows how to swallow and suck out the straw herself. So I'll show you guys in a little. Watch her drink mm -hmm. out of this cup. Oh my gosh. You want some water? Mm -hmm. Want water? <laughs> She's such a big girl. Watch. But yes, guys, uh, like I said, I usually do all the stuff. I'm usually here with mom and dad, so we usually see them in the morning, but they're out of town right now. So it's me and Christina, but she hasn't seen her in a long time, so she's enjoying feeding her and getting her dressed, even though she's not supposed to work night shift and get off at 8 when I start. Yeah, I'm letting her enjoy her time with her. Hi guys, so we give Shah her independent play time. I don't know what time it is, it's probably around 9 a.m. But it's very, very important for this little one right there to get her independent play time. So, you know, we just leave her on bottom. This is where they learn a lot. I'll do a few minutes in here, maybe 20 minutes in here, and then we'll go to her little, her open space so she can crawl and play with her toys in a little bit, okay?
Okay guys, so it's about 9.22 and we're about to, what are we about to do? I'm about to feed Char some milk and then we are going to go out. We're going to go out, Chunky. She's not going out. We're going to go out for a ride and for a walk. <laughs> She's ready to go. Alright, so. Hi, right, who is that? <laughs> That's Char. She's being so nice today, usually when there's a camera there. She is not smiling, but today is a new day. She wants to eat my phone, so we gotta go, guys. All right, so we're gonna go outside. Right now, we have some breast milk defrosted and a little sun, and we got a pack to go outside. We're gonna go watch some kids play. I don't know if I can turn the camera while I'm recording. Let's see. Nope, I gotta wait until I'm done. Anyways, we're getting ready to go outside. We're all packed and ready to go. Char is in the seat over there. Right there, there's Char. And all her things are right here. I'll flip the camera so you guys can see. I said we're going out. We got the Duna stroller. This goes on the back of it. This is our diaper bag. Well, our play bag. And over here we have the baby that's all ready to go. All right, we're all ready. Going out. I got to take these things as well. Christina left. She's so much fun. She's such a big help. And there's the breast milk I have thawing out. It's frozen. So we just have that thawing. Until we come back, it should be good to go. All right, all right, let's move on now. Cats all over the place, excuse me, Cracker. Thank you. Two of them are ours, and the other ones just hang out here. See another cat, all right. We're outside, this is our ride for the day. We're gonna put this beautiful thing Roller in there. Let me lock it so she doesn't roll anywhere. Okay. Like I said, we're gonna go out. Um, there's kids that should be playing today. It's Friday. They should be playing. If she's too young for their age. And the stroller turns into a car seat, which is really cool and really convenient. Now she's all in the golf cart, all ready to go. Bags are back here, and I will be driving up there. And no, I will not be recording while I'm driving. So you guys will see when I get there. We're just taking a walk now. I'm just taking a break. Taking a break so Shar can eat. We picked up our mail and we're just hanging out outside. It is pouring outside right now. We are stuck in the rain. Thank goodness we sat down here so she can eat a bottle. Well, I'll drink a bottle. Because we would have been caught in the rain on our walk. You can't really tell, but you can hear it. Listen. Yeah, it's raining. I love baby toes. Look at the baby toes. Look at the baby feet. Look at this. Aww, look at them. Look at his toes. Look at the toes. Look at them. Look at them. So now our golf cart is all wet. Because it just finished raining. Um, I'm gonna have to take the blanket out the bag that we were using for the beach and put it on my seat. Because I'm not gonna sit in that. Right, Chunky? All right, there we have it. We are ready to go. Now we have Paw Patrol back here. And Char doing whatever she's doing. So, Char's naps are about every two hours and she eats six ounces every two hours. It's supposed to be every three hours, but she sleeps through the night, 12 hours through the night. So, hey, she's stuck. Say, I'm stuck. I need help. And here's Stumper. He wants someone to pet him. And the other pups. There's five of them. And, and now my ABCs. Next time, won't you sing with me? Yeah! ABCs guys she does where you going oh. <laughs> now it is nap time so what we do for nap is we just put Char in her crib with her pacifier and while she's awake just like this but she's tired we put her in there and then we let her go to sleep by herself the self-soothing techniques help with her to sleep 12 hours, 10 to 12 hours every single night. She needs to learn how to go to sleep 
a wig, right? So watch. Oh my gosh, it is pouring outside again. I'm glad we got back inside, you know, before we got rained on again. Um, yeah, but it's been a couple minutes. I put her down at 1027, it's 1033, and I think she's asleep. Let's see, I'll show you. So usually when she takes a nap for an hour and a half or two hours, I either go outside, I'm reading something. I usually have the monitor, but now I have the camera on my phone, so I don't need to bring the monitor with me. Um, right now, I'm just going to go on my computer and do some stuff uh, until she wakes up. So yeah, so on my off time, I can be on my phone, I can make phone calls, I can do whatever it is I please to do as long as um, I'm in the house, you know, or you know, near the house so I can go upstairs when she starts crying or waking up. Um, but yeah, I'm just chilling right now. I'm going to do something on my computer and then probably watch some TV in my room. So, be back. Okay, so it is 12 o'clock. Shaw woke up. She slept for about an hour and a half. And we're here about to read some books. Of course, reading books every day to your children is very, very, very important. Let's read some books. Let's read... Um, can I read this one? Five little monkeys jumping on the bed. It was bedtime, so five little monkeys took a bath. Five little monkeys put in their pajamas. Five little monkeys brushed their teeth. Five little monkeys said good night to their mama. Then five little monkeys jumped on the bed. I like to keep all her bottles organized so I kind of like put them together because these bottles are like three steps four steps put them together put them all in here so she has all her bottles these are where we warm up her breast milk put in there her cups are back there uh, oh, it's gonna be in here I think we run out of space her forks and spoons are supposed to be in here and teethers and teething toys and things of that sort so we're gonna try our walk again our walk ride kind of thing again because we got rain on earlier hopefully now we have better luck looks much nicer now the sky looks much clearer so hopefully chunky we can actually take a good walk yeah well that's that guys that's my day from eight to four pretty much well it's three now but she sleeps so she'll probably be asleep till around then uh but yeah so that's our day well the day i'm a living nanny um, my day, not every living nanny, everyone's completely different. You won't find two families that are the same. But yeah, that's just like how my day is. I ate lunch. Just now, I ordered lunch from Panella, this restaurant down there. Me and Charlotte went to pick it up on our walk, our drive. Yeah, so now I'm just hanging out until Christina gets here. But usually, um, it's the mom. Um, it's Beth that, you know, stays with her. We don't usually have two nannies all the time. But like I said, they're out of town. But yes. Today was a good day, so I had a good day. Um, yeah, so enjoy your Friday. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you got something out of it, um, or I hope you enjoyed it. Um, it wasn't very educational, but yeah. Yeah. See you guys.